No way in the world should anyone ever be this close to a wild bear. The bear didn't like its space being invaded, and although it was initially pretty laid back, this became an interesting but scary moment. Another close grizzly encounter, and these people are way more relaxed than they should be. Luckily, this bear is pretty laid back, but you have to wonder if this was worth the risk. People watching the bear stroll up the Cleanlands Dome Trail screamed in terror as a park visitor stared into the jaws of a 300-pound bear. Just a few minutes before photographer Mark Poff took these pictures, a crowd of visitors had put the bear on the move in the nearby parking lot by getting dangerously up close and personal with a Smokies bear. This man is less than 15 feet from a call to 911. Getting as close as 15 feet away from a powerful 300-pound black bear, like... I don't know why people try to run from an animal that can run 35 miles per hour. Folks, Usain Bolt back in his prime could only run 27 miles an hour. So, uh, these things are fast. You know what? I don't know if he'd have gone the other way or not until I got off that trail. Because it wasn't until the park ranger said, get off the trail and move up, did that bear move, move away. So, I guess he's... Maybe he's as afraid of us as we are of him. I don't know. <laughs> Let's hope so. Tell me about it. There's <laughs> mama and two cubs very close to us. This bear has to be at least 800 pounds, I bet. It's huge. Being this close to mama and her cubs seems, uh... Risky to say the least. Awesome. Awesome. It's about the coolest thing that'll ever happen to you on a bear trip. <laughs> yeah, that it was close. Get any better than that. It oh, goodness. I hope everybody got a lot of shots. Did you? Yeah. yeah. Betty, how was that? <laughs> You better believe that this driver in Alaska didn't expect this bear, who crossed the road once, to double back and then charge. This was insane and I'm glad they weren't on foot or on a bicycle. Oh my god, go, 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 hit the gas, he's right next to us. Holy fuck, we just got charged by a bear. <laughs> Like, what are these bears doing? Whatever it is, they aren't paying these guys any mind. At least not this time. No ai voie aici. No ai voie aici. Nu înțelegi că nu ai voie. Du-te în pădurea ta. Știu că tu vrei ceva, dar n-am ce să-ți dau. Nu ai voie aici. Hai să facem un concurs. Hai de după mine. Hai de dragul. Hai. This bear is annoyed yet cautious. Obviously, it's a pretty young bear, but it's still a doggone bear. And this ski instructor, going downhill, activated its prey drive, and it quickly gave chase. Oh boy, see ya! Hi, fuji pe dure ca dupa aia te iau astia si ce pe unde ajungi. His, his fatal move.
Look, you gotta have some huge cojones to not run from a bear, but run towards it. Maybe if I shoot it, you get some dying quivers there, uh, Look out! Oh, hey, there he is! Это мои пирожки, блядь! Это мои наразы! A man in Siberia nearly met his maker when a polar bear gets too close. <laughs> this video is the epitome of cute. A bear cub can't get enough of this man. Like, I wouldn't do this because it's not good for humans nor bears, as bears should naturally have a fear of humans. I mean, imagine this thing fully grown, walking up to someone like wanting to play. He is going to wind up as a fancy rug. When a bear showed up in one man's backyard, there was no horsing around. Only on 7, Action 7 News anchor Tanya Mendez went to Durango, where a pair of horses took on a bear and won. As I thought, that looks like an awful big dog. <laughs> And then when I looked again and got the binoculars, I was like, wow, wait a minute. Wait a minute is right. A closer look, and this is what Jack Llewellyn saw. I mean, I'm sitting there watching the, the bear running for his dear life. A black bear in his Durango backyard and a few crazy horses taking a stand. So I woke up my wife and said, you won't believe this. Come check this out. The horses stood tough on their turf. Like, okay, let's let him know. Llewellyn's wife started snapping pictures as the horses gave chase, hunting the bear through the pasture along the fence line and the bear tried to hide from the horses. Wow, talk about potential prey becoming the predator. These horses wanted all the smoke when they saw a bear and they were ready to literally kick its butt. Turf. Okay, let's let him know. Llewellyn's wife started snapping pictures as the horses gave chase, hunting the bear through the pasture along the fence line and the bear tried to hide from the horses. He was in full sprint running along and then the horses um, would stop for a little bit, he would stop and rest, and then they would take off again. Thanks for watching. I'm Curtis. See you next time. Okay. Do good, do great, and they talk bad on you. No me, no face, cause they're not factual. No, no, no. I won't stay too long here, I'm just passing through. I might hit the bank and get a bag or two. My mama asked me why you got that cash room. Second you switch up, they might get mad at you.